Hello everyone, this is Janice with Cricketology.blogspot.com and today um, I am on episode 5 of the Dinosaur Tracks um, series and I wanted to show you how I did the banner for Adrian's birthday party and I, I had to use the book for this because if you look here you hit the shift no, I'm sorry, not the shift on the letter feature the alphabet, the font, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, there's an uppercase, and then there's a, let's see, is that the uppercase and lowercase? No, there's no lowercase, it's just uppercase. Now, um, it does have a shadow, okay? Now, however, the shadow is not on the same button it's actually under shadow and letter shadow and on my gypsy it doesn't even say letter shadow it just says shadow so what you have to do is go over to the shadow under the shadow in the shift all right and then you have to go over here in your book and you see there the third third row down first button is the shadow for the A, okay, because the A is on the third row, first button, okay, so you come here, and when you're on the shift of the shadow function, you go one, two, three, and there is, that is the shadow for the letter A, and you do the same thing for all the letters that you need to spell out, and you cut them out at the same exact size that you cut your font out. Okay, so I'm going to show you how I um, put it together. I think I could have done it a little more easily, but I didn't have a voice of reason to say, hey, wait a minute, there's an easier way to do this. Let me show you the yarn that I found. I was going to use rope, like hemp rope from Walmart, but the big roll like this was like $12, no, $9, which was more than I wanted to pay t for this you know, little banner for a birthday party. And it's, this is what it looks like. And it's, it was a dollar at Big Lots. And look at all that I have left. And it's just, it's real soft. And I could see myself using this on a card or a layout. And, um, what else did I want to show you? Okay, let's see. I hope I don't make anybody dizzy or sick. I'm going to walk over to I look at my kitchen. Hope it's not. Hope we don't see anything. We're not supposed to see. Okay, so there it is. It's super long. Okay, they were cut at five inches, and see, I just thread this through this stuff. I thread it through front, back, and then through the front again, and continued that all the way. And then in between the words, that's my dryer. I tried to go ahead and tie little knots just to separate the words. Okay, and so there it is. And I really like it, and I think it's going to be really cute, and I love the paper that I used. I used that My Mind's Eye um, Chomp paper stack that's all dinosaurs. Okay, so thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this series and I may have one more episode. Not sure. Thanks for watching. Bye.